Hey, 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 everybody, what is up? Serial Lover Drive here, and today we are playing Entropia Universe. I'm doing a 50 PED mining run. I got a little bit into it. This is what we've mined so far 1.68 PEDs in Force Nexus, and here's where we're mining. You guys know why I'm doing Treasure Island City. I got a huge, huge, massive hoff out here. And I'm trying again, see if I can't hit it. I had no amps, nothing. I'm doing it again. No amps, just 50 PEDs of probes. We're going to see what we can hit and uh, go from there. I know you guys, I was doing hunting videos before because of Merry Mayhem. It is still going on, I believe, as I'm making this video. But I thought it would be cool to do something else, change it up a little bit. This gives me a little bit more ability to talk to you guys and just sort of, you know, chat about the channel, everything that's going on and all that. Because I've been gone for a while, you know. Holidays were here. And um, now the holidays are pretty much gone. I'm not going anywhere doing anything for New Year's Eve. That's a whole other story. But basically, I'm going to be around. So the videos should be coming out on a fairly regular basis right now. Now, first things first, the microphone. I know a few of you guys mentioned the microphone was a little bit subpar. So part of the reason for that, there's, there's a few different reasons for that. One, I keep moving the microphone. So when I find a place that it works, it's a little bit hard for me to keep setting it up every time. Um, the obvious solution to that would be like, oh, hey, cereal, just stop moving it. Well, it's a little bit hard to do given, you know, the housing costs in Boston and the fact that I do not want to pay an extra, you know, $500, $600 a month due to wanting another room that I can set up a computer in. That's also why I have a laptop. It turns out buying a $1,000 laptop is way cheaper than buying a whole other room to set a desktop up in. And um, that, that's just reality of living in the city and reality of not being, you know, some sort of 100,000, 200, 300,000 subscriber streamer or more, right? Because if I had that many stream or not streamer, YouTuber, whatever you want to call it, if I had that many subs, it would be a lot more, well, it would be a lot easier for me to do stuff just because there's more monetary value there. So you have a little bit more to play with. I could get that extra room. But as it is right now, and I'm fine with that, it's just not there. So. That's why I'm using the laptop. That's why the mic sort of changes in volume and stuff like that because I'm moving it around. I think I know roughly where to place it, roughly where to talk. When I was doing that video yesterday, I was trying to do it in a different room just because of um, noises that were outside of my control. And I, I was hoping that the microphone would come through clear, but I think there was a little bit too much just echo in it. Um, unfortunately, I'm going to have to start broadcasting from a different room, so we'll see what we can do. Maybe I'll... Go we'll get some, you know, padding or something like that to help sort of dampen the echo. Um, but yeah, I'll, I'll see what I can do about the mic. If this sounds good, let me know. If it sounds bad and you're still not happy, let me know. We're just going to keep playing with it. And hopefully we can get something good. I am using a blue snowball microphone. Uh, so far, I like the mic, honestly. It's way better than it was before. The only problem is I do have to deal with it picking up this laptop fan sometimes so if i stop talking it sounds a little bit weird sometimes that's why i try to just keep that continue continuous dialogue flowing if i stop you're going to start hearing fans you're going to hear background noises also i have the volume turned down low just so it doesn't pick up that or volume and sensitivity turned down a little bit lower so it doesn't pick up all that stuff and as i say that i'm playing with the mic because i'm hoping that's going to fix something but it probably just messed up my audio um but yeah, I mean, a lot of you guys are right. A lot of it's just simply I don't want to spend the money for, like, the top-of-the-line microphone and all that. Um, it is what it is. Entropia Universe doesn't have a million people playing it, so there's no way for me to get a lot of subscribers doing videos like this. So, you know, that's how it goes. I put in what I'm willing to put in, and um, we'll, we'll figure out a way to make it work, guys. We will. We will. Um, anyways. On to the next subject, because there's really not much more to say about that. Um, I'm sort of steadfast in the fact that I don't want to buy a new mic so soon after buying this one right here. And I also bought a laptop, so it's you know, a bit of an investment, I feel like. Um, the laptop I needed, though, but you know, I did jack it up a little bit, so it was a little bit easier to stream on, to play on, to do everything like that. Um, anyways, next topic would be videos coming out. I know what you guys want, and... Those videos are coming. Uh, the Arcadia Moon Deeds, I wanted that one out right away because I knew I've had a lot of you guys messaging me about that. So, like, first things first, I got back from my trip. I was like, all right, got a little bit of time. Let's do this video. Let's get it out of the way real quick. Oh, some, something's attacking me. That's not good. It's probably a hoglo. It's going to kill me, isn't it? Yep, it's a hoglo. It's going to. Oh, come on. Keep missing me, buddy. Keep missing me. Oh, god damn it. 
you know, this area is not giving me much anyway, so we're going to change it up, go somewhere else. Um, I, I, I'm, I do that. If an area doesn't seem to be hot, I'm going to move areas. That's just how you should play. Anyways, uh, video-wise, we're going to be coming out with some good stuff, hopefully. I'm going to be doing a trading video. One of you guys wanted a melee video. I'll be doing that. Uh, beginner's guide videos. I'm going to do beginner's guide to pretty much everything you can think of. And, you know, just a bunch of generic sort of 2018 updated videos because I know a lot of you guys have been asking for those in Tropia Universe. One person asked me to keep doing Project Zomboid Let's Play videos, so I'm going to be doing that and I'll keep putting out that Fortnite Battle Royale content, even though no one's really interested in that much to my dismay. Um, the reason I'm doing other things other than in Tropia Universe is just because it's it's good to have a variety of videos going up on your channel if you look at my channel most of my views do not come from entropia universe videos or they come from maybe two or three specific entropia universe videos uh it's sort of the nature of the beast i do like this because this gives me like uh basically doing the last plays doing the talks like this it gives me more of a just generic subscriber or not generic sorry um a more loyal subscriber base or something like that it gives me um, people that, you know, they keep coming back to my videos, it's cool to see, like, you, you get to sort of know the people that are commenting on your videos, I think, you know, you guys got to know me, I got to know you, um, so, you know, don't worry, I'm gonna keep doing the Entropia Universe stuff, but I like to expand, I like to try new things, and I think it's no secret that I do like to play a variety of games, it's like right now I'm doing Fortnite all the time, honestly, if I could stream Fortnite, I'd probably be doing it every night. The thing is, I just don't get any viewers because I'm not that good. I usually finish, like, top 10. I'm not a top 3, top 1 player. Um, I, I don't think I've even won a game on the computer. I'm just, you know, I can pull top 10, and that's the best I can do. Uh, what else is there? I keep saying um a lot right now. I'm, I've got to get back into the streaming habits. So, yeah, I'm going to keep doing some other videos just to see if anything like that will catch. And every now and then you get something that's not... That it just is something beyond what this channel usually puts out. Usually my videos, I'll get maybe 100 to 500 views per video, which is great. Uh, every now and then, though, I'll come out with a video like that just takes off for whatever reason. It doesn't even, I don't even know when, why, whatever. Sometimes it's just like I'll put out a how-to video and five years later the video gets, you know, a thousand hits in a weekend because... Xbox One decided to release the game for free, or, you know, something like that happens, and then, you know, it's it's cool to see, it's good for me, I get some extra views, and I like getting views just because you guys know I'm going for that 1 million view, um, I don't know, goal, level, whatever, there's no level really, but it's sort of cool to hit, uh, oof. So, yeah, I guess that's what's coming with the videos. Um, got into that because one of you guys want Project Zomboid, so I'll be doing that too. What else do we have? As far as... I'm just trying to think of everything that's been asked to me over this weekend because I want to answer it. I do see that PM down there, and I'll get that later. That's how PMs work. Uh, what else is there, man? It, it's sort of hard to come up with stuff, honestly. I don't know why. I think you guys saw the area I changed to. This is seemingly pretty good. I pretty good area. Uh, what happened here? There we go. All right. Anyways, video wise, that's sort of what we're looking at. You guys are gonna see a lot of the videos that you've been looking for now, just because um, it, it's always. I like to update these videos every year. I don't want to be spamming it, so I don't want to do a video, the same video over and over every three months. Uh, if I was just purely interested in views, that would be the best way to do it, but I'm not. I think people would be annoyed, they'd leave, they wouldn't subscribe, because it's annoying. You don't want to see, like, Serial Overdrive's Beginner Guide to Hunting, you know, the October edition, then the November edition, and newbies are going to see that and be like, well, what changed? I don't know, this game's so confusing, why does it change every month? Um, so I think once a year is a good, good way to do it. Also, I, I keep wanting to put more time into it. I just don't know how to edit videos, which is like, oops. Probably should work on that. I keep saying I will, but I keep working on work. Uh, as it would turn out, that's, you know, the thing that pays me the most is the thing that takes precedent. YouTube is just my for fun hobby. So, yeah. 
what else is there to go over? Um, I mean, I hope I hope you guys all had a great Christmas. I really did. Um, I had a great Christmas. Can't complain. I, you know, hope you guys had a good Christmas or holiday or whatever. Even if you're just, you know, getting a three-day weekend, I hope it was a great three-day weekend. Maybe you uh, took advantage of there being no lines anywhere and went out and did some, I don't know, donuts in an empty parking lot that usually isn't empty. Whatever, you know, take advantage of it. And what else do we have? Yeah, as far as Entropia goes, it's been pretty stable. Um, you know where I stand with Arcadia Moon Deeds. Not happy about it, but what, what can you do? I really don't like that they're shying away from offering things for PED values. I know that they're trying to encourage depositing, but I don't think that's the way to do it. And if anything, that would almost encourage me not to deposit because then... I feel like I might want to hold off and just use the money I've got in-game and wait to deposit because then I can buy a deed or something like that later. Maybe they'll come out with something cool that I want to buy and I can't get it with my PEDs. It also really detracts from the fact that they keep saying PEDs are worth USD. If they're worth USD, why can't I use them as USD, especially on the EntropiaUniverse.com website? I get why Amazon.com doesn't take, you know, Entropia Universe PEDs. But why doesn't Entropia Universe take PEDs instead of dollars? They just want me to withdraw it and then get that like nice little conversion fee? It's, I don't know, it's a bit weird in my opinion. Um, I know some of you guys don't feel that way. I've watched other people talking about it, and some of you guys seem overjoyed that depositors are getting an advantage. Which I get, like if you're a depositor, you feel like you've contributed more to the game. And in some ways you have, in some ways, you know, you're equals. Um, I'd, I'd argue that someone like me doing videos like this probably contributes a bit more than someone who deposits, you know, $10 a month for, you know, a few months. But hey, it, it's everybody's personal opinion, and obviously Mindark, I, I don't know if they need the deposits or what. Um, I, the, more I, the more I see that they're doing, the more I feel like they might be in need of a bit of a cash rejuvenation and you know maybe the moon's the perfect way to do that i don't know i don't know we'll just have to wait and see what happens so keep going on that um what else do we have cryptocurrency it's still you know pretty insane as always oh this is cool some little components that i can't pick up how sad let's mine right here what do you guys think right in the smoke let's get my clothes all nice and smoky Mind Dark's going to introduce a washing machine pretty soon that I'm going to have to use to clean those clothes, but that's neither here nor there. Oh, it worked. What do you know? Let's get this thing first. I don't know why I'm jumping up the hill, honestly. I can call the D to me. It might be faster. I could probably run around the hill. It would be faster. I could get my plane out, fly up, and land on the D, and it would be faster. But just like Skyrim, I choose to jump it. All right. And now that we're here, let's get that mining going. Oh, all right, that was quick. I put my hands down. Oh, wait, no. That was not quick. I put my hands down, and I'm like, all right, let's stretch a little bit. I just got off a plane, so a little cramped. You guys know how it is, though. You're stuck on a plane in economy in the back, uh, you know, back of a plane for you know, maybe, what, four or five hours? It gets a little cramped. It gets a little annoying. So I'm just trying to stretch out right now. Uh, trying to stretch out, play some games, post some videos, or at least get some videos out. I like to pre-record a bit because I know I'm going to be busy when I get back to work. So this will give me the ability to post videos without actually being there. Let's see if we can land right on it. Oh, oh, that works. We're good. We're good. I just don't move that mouse. All right, so we got some crude oil there. That's cool. That's going to get me a little bit closer to those achievements. Um, as far as New Year's goes, I, I don't know if I have any good video ideas for New Year's. I like to do a Christmas video, but maybe I should do New Year's too. I don't know, do you guys have any ideas for a New Year's video? If anyone on here has any ideas for a New Year's video, let me know. Uh, oh, also as far as streaming goes, I'll get back to it one time. It's just right now it's easier for me not to stream, so I don't stream. The reason streaming is good and bad is because streaming picks up everything in the background. Right now, every now and then, just a lot of noise gets created. And there's no, 
Wow, we get three three in a row here. This this area is pretty hot right now. Um, there's a lot of noise in the background, and sometimes I'll edit it out, or sometimes I'll just toss a video because hey, a bunch of sirens came by. The police stopped, and it was just nonstop sirens. When I was doing, so I did try streaming a little bit more often. I was streaming maybe like once a week at one point. It worked out until it didn't. And the problem is like there's a lot of negativity that comes when you start up a stream and then you're like, oh, sorry, got to stop it. Something came up. Everybody's like, what the what? two minute stream? And then I hear about it on YouTube and all that. I'm like, oh, I don't know. Anything that gets me hate, I generally don't do just because it, it affects your mood. It's weird, right? Like a bunch of people sound like, oh, this is awesome. Like that makes you feel good. Then one person comes on like, what the fuck? You know, they're talking about all this. They come on to talk shit, basically. And if it gets you at the wrong time, it can really, like, ruin your day. Or not your day, but your hour, at least, right? Like, you're looking at it and you're like, what? I didn't, I didn't no. No, I told you the stream was not going to be a long one. I, what? So, I don't know. You know how it is. People like to vent, and sometimes when they vent, they, you know, it has repercussions they're not thinking of. So I'm definitely guilty of it too. So it's not it's not a big deal, but I don't know. Whoa, two more. Jesus Christ. This this is a hot area. Look at that right there. Those of you looking for a profitable zone. I think you know where to go. I think you know where to go. Man. I thought I was gonna do fifty PDs. I thought I had so much jeez. Four? All right, let's drop again. We're just going to keep doing this. We are not stopping until we get a nothing found or run out of probes. Jesus Christ. All right. Um. Wow. There's going to be a lot of... All right. The streak is over, but look at this. That is screenshotable. So, what are we gonna do? We're gonna take a screenshot. Awesome, got that screenshot. Now let's go mine all of this. So I take those screenshots just for the videos. Um, I've been doing little cover photos. Some of you guys don't like them, some of you do. So, you know, if you don't like them, oh, I missed that one in the photo, oh man. Yeah, so if you don't like those cover the photos I'm doing for the screen, uh, it, tough i i haven't seen any increase honestly this is a weird thing right i got the mic i got the laptop i'm doing screens now i don't see a huge increase in viewership i thought like there'd be a jump i thought there'd be something everything's still going up but it's going up at the same rate it was before um which is a little perplexing to me i was i don't know i don't know what i was expecting uh just thought that was weird Whew. What else do I have? I know a few a few people have been asking for like dual comms or like they want to play with me and Entropia stuff like that. Um, it, it'll happen at some point. I don't know when. It's just uh, it's it's so hard to plan stuff. Uh, just because again, it's about priorities. We've gone over this many many times in this video and other videos, but uh, yeah. If anyone says they were going to like dual com with me or they were going to play with me and then they didn't end up doing it, it's probably not their fault. It's probably mine. Or, you know, it's a mixture of both. Maybe signals got crossed. Someone said something. I don't know. Whatever. But, um, yeah, if, if anyone said they were going to, you know, play with me, it's just, it'll probably happen eventually. It's just, I've got to find the time. Um, yeah. We'll see. It's looking like January is going to be pretty busy, too. Um, I'm just swamped at work, so I don't want to make commitments I can't keep. All right, so let's keep going here. See what we can find. Nothing. I like the water. Look at this. So beautiful. I mean, I know a lot of other games have it better, but man, let's see if we can get some splashing effects going here. Oh, well, there you go. They could do a little bit more, or they could do a little bit less with it, I guess. Um, for an MMO, though, I think these graphics are pretty good. I like the water effect. I like a lot of the stuff they've done. I like the moons. I do think the Entropia Universe needs to be smaller, though. I don't think the moon's a good thing, because 
while you, I went over this, but I, I don't think that I don't think that Mindark should be focusing on adding area. I think they should be focusing on improving the area that they have. Right now, there's vast swaths of just abandoned terrain, land areas, planets. That's not good for a game because newbies get lost there. They can't figure out what's going on. They see no players and they think that they're in a dead world. They think that for some reason these servers have been left off by some gigantic multi-corporation that forgot about them. And the game itself is long gone. So then they just leave. I've heard a lot of people commenting on that. A lot of people are saying the golden age of Entropia is dead. Which people have ironically been saying since the birth of Entropia. But... Yeah, it's, it's, um, I, th I think the large area has a thing to do with that. It almost feels dead to me just because it's so hard to find people nowadays. You never run into anybody when you're playing. This whole thing, the only time I ran into somebody was when I was at, oh, we got a pretty big small here. Let's drop another probe, last probe. Let's see what we can do. Can we get a massive, massive all-time high? Probably not, but let's see. Uh, all right. That was not quite what we were hoping for. That was not not worth the build-up, let's be honest here. But whatever. Um, yeah, it would be nice to see Intro Mindark focusing on user acquisition, user retention. Um, maybe, I don't know, like land. Not land. What would it be? Like playing area refurbishment or improvement? Rather than just adding more, because if you keep adding more and more and more, it's it's not going to do anything if you don't have the player base there. I mean, it's one of the problems that all these procedurally generated games run into. Yeah, you can generate a million worlds, but that doesn't mean you've got a million good worlds. Skyrim gets users because the worlds are intricate. There's thought put behind them. There's stories that you can find. You can find maybe a crash ship, and then miles away you find the ship that you know. This wouldn't be Skyrim, this would be more Fallout. Miles away, you'll find the pilot dead, clutching a note to maybe his daughter or something like that. Entropia Universe has the world, they have the space where they could start putting these little hidden stories into it. They just aren't. They're just focusing on creating more and more and more. Um, I'd like to see a little less focus on that, a little more focus on just creating the right type of thing. Um, I don't know, what do you guys think? I know, oh boy... That's not what I wanted. Um, yeah, let's see how far we are from... Uh, whoa. I'm going to spawn a ship. We can just keep this video going a little bit longer. Because most of you guys don't seem to mind when these videos go long. Oh, no. Did I do it? I think I did. Oh, no. Uh-oh. Oh, boy. Ooh, this is going to be a long run here. So, it turns out... That I left my ship out when I shouldn't have, and it went back to the storage, which means I now have to run all the way back to the nearest teleporter right here. That sucks. That really does, but what, what can you do? Um, let's add this up in our heads here, because if anything makes people love me more, it's proving that my math skills are horrible. So this is three PETs worth. Okay, so we've got 26 already with the belt. I did not realize I got that much. 26. Whoa. 48. Wait, no, no, no. 38. 38. So we're about 43. 50. And... Fifty-three PEDs. We we did it, folks. We made a profit. I had a, had a little bit of a rough run in Treasure Island City. I decided to call it. I came over to a better area. This area where there's no one. I mined right along that oceanfront property. And I managed to get a nice, tidy little profit of three PEDs. Plus some skills. Plus markup. I think that's a win, guys. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed my ramble ramblings, enjoyed my updates and everything like that. If you did, hit that like button. It always helps me out. Hit that like button on my other videos too because it's still going to help me out. Even if you didn't like the video, maybe it'll get to someone who does. And then they'll help me out and whatever. Anyways, thanks for watching, guys. Until next time, peace.